All right. In your composition notebook or your notebook for language arts, you're going to open up to the next available page. And up at the top for your title, you're going to write narrative dash important people. We are going to be starting our narrative, this is a V, narrative writing unit, and we're going to start brainstorming some important people in our life. Our main goal with this unit is to be able to write a narrative story that is a small moment story, so a small moment in time. And sometimes when we are trying to think of these small moments, it helps to kind of get that brainstorming process started by thinking of important people in our life or people that mean a lot to us. And sometimes that will help jot down some memories or help you remember some small moments that were important to you because of these people in your lives. So I'm going to list two people. I'm going to do a T-chart on this page here. I don't even need to make it that big, but I'll just make it this big. Okay, so on one side, I'm going to list my sister, because my sister is pretty important to me. Okay, and then let's just say my dad. Okay, so sister and dad. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to choose two people like I have here, and I'm going to list some favorite memories or just some small moment memories that I have with these people. Um, I'll start with my sister. So my sister and I used to play Barbies all the time when we were little. Um, we always used to have dance parties. We'd make up dances with our neighbors. Um, we played Polly Pockets all the time. We always went to our farm and played around there. We played with our pets. So we played with Oreo, our dog at the time. And we had a cat also. Um, we met Oreo for the first time. Maybe I'll tell that story later. That's a pretty funny story. Um, we used to ride our bikes around the neighborhood a lot. We would go to grandma's house. We would play restaurant in school. At home and at grandma's house, actually. And I think that's quite a few different memories from my sister. So what I would do is choose your first person and think of maybe 10 or so different things that you um, think of when you think of this person or things you used to do if it's a sibling um, and jot them down. Um, okay, so dad. We would play softball together. Basketball, he was always my coach. Um, riding in his truck. We always used to use the metal detector. Detector and find treasures. Um, we would watch movies together a lot. We went ice fishing. We would go watch the varsity basketball games together. Boys and girls basketball games. We travel to the away games together. We'd watch him play baseball. And softball. Um, go shopping. We'd shoot hoops in the driveway. And we would play catch together. Okay, so I'll probably stop there with those two. So what I did was I chose two people that were important in my life, and I wrote down some small moment memories that I had with these people. Okay, now what our goal is is to 
maybe help these different moments or things we used to do with these important people kind of give us this idea of a small moment narrative that we're going to be writing as our paper. Um, if it helps you to do more than two, you can most certainly do more than two. You could even do a pet if you want. You don't have to list it as just people or humans. You can do a pet and do that also as one of your two people. Okay, and then that is it for today. So make sure that you have these moments written down. Like I said, just five to 10 memories or so. Doesn't have to be a long list, but just five or 10.